My name is Ben Brill. I've crossed the longest rivers on a ship. I get lost in the largest rainforests. I've climbed the highest mountains in my dreams. And I survived the impossible. Clumsy survival. Well, today I'm in Marjave's desert. This is one of the hottest deserts in the world. When you get lost in the desert, you need have no food prejudices. To overcome the nausea can be the difference between life and death. Oh, shit, it hurts. But, look, I found this picnic here. I think some weekenders forget it here, so it's a good way to find food or some to drink. Oh, this is disgusting but it will provide me some calories. Okay, oh my god, it tastes too yummy. Desert can be a hot place, so I will need to find some shadows to rest. I'm trying to find some fresh water, it will be difficult cause there ain't oasis in the USA. So I'm going to use my psychic to keep fresh myself. The most dangerous species in the desert is the cactus. If you prick with their spines, I can promise you it hurts a lot, so watch out. Light a bonfire is a good idea, for banish dangerous species such snakes but it can attract others. The native people tells, the space visitors land this place at nights but I have a sharpen with me. The fire will keep me warm during the night. Look. Do you listen it? They should be the space visitors. So it's hunting time. I will prepare my sharpen. And if I'm lucky, I will get something for breakfast. I listen them by this way. One of my friends, who fought in World War II, told me this trick. When you meet aliens, you should look for their weakest point. And hit them. I can see, that they have testicles, as Earth people do. I should hit them there. This is sort of universal cannibalism, but they are tasty if you fry them before in a barbie. This one is still a bit musty. And he was talking about the and he said, Mountain Ginger and Pink. I made a good one with the weather. But I didn't know about that. And he was talking about the same and he said, Mountain Ginger and Pink. I made a good one with the weather. But I didn't know about that. He was done. It sounds like an explosion. Oh my god, World War 3 has started. Well, next episode of Clumsy Survival, I gonna teach you how to survive during a war.